48-year-old male with history of HIV AIDS who presented to the ER with gradual decline in mental status. There is a confluent region of T1 hypointense and T2 flare hyperintense signal in the subcortical, periventricular, and deep white matter of the right frontal lobe. There is very minimal mass effect on the overlying cerebral cortical sulci, and there was no asymmetric effacement of the lateral ventricles. The signal abnormality extends via the genu and anterior body of the corpus callosum to involve the white matter of the left frontal region. On the T2-weighted images, there are scattered regions of cystic change within the lesion. There are no suspicious findings on the diffusion images or blood volume perfusion maps. There is no suspicious post-contrast enhancement. The imaging findings are most consistent with the diagnosis of progressive multifocal leukoencephalopathy, or PML for short. PML is a myelinating disease resulting from oligodendrocyte infection with the JC virus. PML is usually associated with an immunocompromised status, such as an HIV AIDS. Transplant patients and those with leukemia may also be affected. In AIDS, PML typically develops with CD4 counts below 50 to 100 cells per microliter.